one world. Many ideas. Inspiring the next generation. Shaping trends and forging the future. CEO Exchange. And now, Jeff Greenfield. I'm delighted to welcome you to a new season of CEO Exchange. We are back with new guests, a very different business environment, but with the same idea we started with, talking and listening to the men and women at the top of American business. So, to the business at hand. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome CEO of Southwest Airlines, Gary Kelly. Please welcome the chairman and CEO of Comcast, Brian Roberts. Chairman and CEO of Mattel, Bob Eckert. Commissioner of the National Basketball Association, David Stern. Chairman and CEO of Marriott International, Bill Marriott. Do you ever stay at the competition to see how they're doing? Not very often. It costs too much. <laughs> <laughs> President and CEO of Royal Phillips Electronics, Gerard Kleisterly. Many, many years, I would say, I, I thought CEOs were people from a different planet. I mean, they, they knew how to do things that I never would be able to do. We want to learn how they got where they got, what they've learned along the way, not just about business, but about themselves and about life. Well, the low moment was when I got fired, uh, yeah. and the high moment actually is right now. Because the decision that the CEOs make affect all of us every day, from how we earn, to how we learn, to how we work, to how we play, CEO exchanges a lot more than a show about profit and loss. You want my screen? If you want to be successful, care more about your employees than you do yourself. Perhaps one of the most underrated skills that a CEO can possess is the ability to listen. And as part of our corporate culture, we say we want to have a fun-loving attitude. We want to enjoy our work uh, and enjoy each other. I began to be fascinated by the sport itself and all of its nuances, never dreaming that I'd wind up with a career in baseball. We have a Nordstrom-suited gentleman here. Are you a Starbucks uh, regular customer? Well, I, I, I must come clean. I think I'm the only guy in Seattle. I don't drink coffee. <laughs> CEO Exchange is traveling to business schools all over the country. Columbia Business School. The University of Washington Business School. The Wharton School of the University of Pennsylvania. The McComb School of Business at Austin. Kellogg School of Management at Northwestern University. The Howard University School of Business. We turn to the lightning round. It's your last meal. Where is it? What do you eat? Oh, it's at home. He's whispering Starbucks in my ear. <laughs> It's your last meal. What do you eat? Where do you eat it? I'm at Burger King around the corner. McDonald's number seven. Oh, a double cheeseburger. Frankfurter. Pepperoni pizza. Pepperoni pizza. Pancakes, but now make sure now that you put salt in it. Last meal. Not Where? with him. <laughs> if you have one, what's on your iPod? Don't have one. Glenn Miller. <laughs> what's on your iPod? Probably just those Nash and Young. I got uh, Neil Young, uh, Guns N' Roses, Warrant. Guns N' Roses? Yeah. Wow. Play? Well, I don't even have an iPod, yeah. so how's that? You ever call in sick? Uh, who would I call into? <laughs> Before I get too old, I really want to shoot my age in golf. I'd like to get good at golf. Break 70 in the golf course. Enjoy golf. <laughs> That's the business of CEO Exchange. I'm Jeff Greenfield. Thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you next time. CEO Exchange.